In today's episode of The Tenant, I'm in Mumbai. In Mumbai, I'm in Lower Parel, the central business district. And in Lower Parel, I'm in a building ranked as the tallest by the number of floors in India. It's a 78 floor building, part of a project called a Lodha Park. Our tenant today is a young 23 year old person staying in a three bedroom apartment along with two other roommates. What works for him over here and what doesn't? Let's find out. So this is it. This is your uh, yeah. den. Welcome to my small home. Nothing fancy as such. <laughs> it doesn't look too small. The hall looks to be reasonably spacious. Yeah, yeah. How's it going with you? Good, good. So how big is the space? So this is uh, 1100 square feet and I've recently shifted here seven months back. 1st April 2022. Okay. And yeah. you stay alone here? or No, I stay with two of my friends. So total three of us stay here. Okay. And uh, it's a 3 BHK, we've taken it on rent and the rent gets shared between the three of us. Okay. So it's a 3 BHK apartment that you're sharing with two others? Right. So three people? Right. Okay. Right. So what gets you to this sort of a place? Yeah, I think that's a good question. Uh, the answer is right in front of you. Actually, I'll just show you. The two main reasons for me coming here are one is the view which I get. So this is the view which I get from my room as well. And okay. that's a view which I cherish and admire the most. And number two, as you can see, is the amenities area. So I am a big fan of almost all the amenities which are there, like be it swimming pool, be it table tennis, be it the cafe, be it the library, be it the gym. It's as good as like I am, like the amenities are built for me only as a person. I say like that, Kavika, you know, I have And I know almost everyone there. I mean, like, whoever is guard, who is in the cafe, mein, like all the people who are there, I know almost every one of them. What gets you to Lower Parel? Lower Parel right. is, it has a lot of fancy buildings. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Right now here it doesn't look like that, but uh, <laughs> yeah. at, at a peak hour traffic is insane. Yeah, uh, absolutely. Why this location? Yeah, that's a good question. I think Lower Paril is somewhat very fascinating to me to be honest. It looks like the New York of Bombay when like at night times with all the tall buildings and all. And mostly it's for uh, like, it's, it's just for my own purpose in terms of, I used to work at Aditya Birla Group previously. So I was working at Aditya Birla Group which is in Birla Centurion, just opposite to Kamla Mills. So that was the primary reason I chose this location. And I thought that instead of wasting my time traveling in traffic, you know Mumbai's traffic, it's insane. Like anyone who shifts here from a different city, I am from a different city in Nasik. I shifted here in Mumbai and I was like, traffic is the worst thing over here. So it's like I want to save time on traveling. So I calculated that time, if I live in the inside, I have to give 500 per cap to de padta, per travel one side, from inside to lower parallel. So 1000 into 20, 20,000 was going to travel mate. So they add it and add it in the rent and pay a expensive rent. Pay kar dete. The math was working similar only. So I thought let's move to lower parallel. It's like one of the posh locations of Bombay. Let's try to experience this. And let's try to just uh, you know, save time on traveling, save time. And you said that you came from Nasik to Mumbai. Hai. Yeah. Uh, Nasik ki choda Mumbai mein kya hai jo Nasik mein nahi hai? Yeah, life is happening here. Like every day once I wake up at 6.30, 7am in the morning, I'll feel like okay, today I have to do something and I'll be very excited. Nasik mein the work day it starts at 11, 11.30am and it ends by 6, 6.30pm. And uske baad log relax karte, chill karte and they're like, chalo, aaj paan ki shop mein jayege. Like, my dad is a big fan of paan and all. So he goes to the paan shop every night at 9.30 to 10.30pm. Unga fixed routine hai. Nasik mein everyone is very chill. So Nasik is good if you want to retire, if you want to have that life. What do you spend most of your time in the living room for? Kya kya I think hai? eating is one, lunch and dinner, that's the one. Then second is reading, I like to read. And third one is playing guitar, I have my guitar there. And I usually play guitar at nights, maybe twice a week or thrice a week. Once I just want to release my stress or just get up, like get refreshed. Come up to meet you, tell you I'm sorry. We've seen this part. Yeah. Why don't we see the bedroom? Sure, you absolutely. And uh, see how it's shaping up. Yeah, sure. Uh, these are the two rooms. These are locked. Uh, so this one is of my roommate who's working in Luda Group and marketing team. This one is of my roommate who's working in Motila Dosaj in the research team. Okay. And three of us stay here. Unfortunately, we won't be able to visit there because it's locked. Okay. And this is my small <laughs> room with my small piece of set up, sorry for the mess which is there. Well, a bachelor and, uh, should have that. <laughs> yeah, otherwise you won't be able to judge if he's a bachelor, bachelor or not. 
So this is my small setup as well where I try to record my content with my camera and this is the green screen I set over there. And apart from that, yeah, I enjoy the view as well. Like it's as good as if I'm working from here sometimes and I just want a very nice view. I just look at the right side for five minutes and I'm like done for the day, relaxed. <laughs> this gives me more uh, power and energy to work efficiently and smoothly. And this is like a to-do list which I prepare every morning on the whiteboard. So like today it's only three of them, but usually it's six, seven whenever I have a hectic day. So if I'm sitting here, I usually look at the to-do list and I'm just ensuring that okay, this is your agenda board. Yeah, this is my agenda board. Okay. Right? This is where you do all your recordings? Yeah, this is where I do my recordings with this camera. I sit here and this is the green screen in the background and I ask my editor and team to change the background. So they change the green screen, uh, they change like to any any other background, whichever I want. Since you mentioned about this one, uh, you have two roommates, single people I assume. Yeah. Uh, most people in Mumbai and other cities have a problem with bachelors, hmm. landlords and societies. Here there was no issue for you guys? That's a good question again actually. There was an issue initially, but we had to convince that uh, we are like, you know, we come from a very good family background. We come from a renowned like family background and we also are working in corporates. So basically, everyone is working in like a multinational company. So Kushal, uh, uh, there are a lot of strengths in Yeah. Weakness is what is this place? Ki? I think weaknesses would be that the room sizes are very small here. I think that if you want to go to Bombay, you should have to be small height. Chhoti honi because otherwise, it will be like that you will have to be room size occupy and you will not have space. Hi nahi room sizes are small, 10 by 12 I think it uh, It's not more than that. The second thing is uh, the ventilation part. Actually, the windows jo hai, they open only to the extent of 50 percent so there's no like there's lesser ventilation is what i feel or though windows are here and there's no balcony as such like baki buildings maybe the world house or whatever balconies wagara there's no balcony if there's balcony hota to main pure videos wahan se record kar leta this bedroom has an attached bathroom right 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 okay. there's an attached bathroom as well okay okay this is reasonably spacious size yeah yeah the bathroom is reasonably spacious and uh, i think uh, like it, it is like as good as a proper five star bathroom itself. So in this place, uh, the bedroom, yeah, you spend most of your time. Yeah, I think almost sleeping time of eight hours and even after that almost ten hours of maybe working from home as of now because I have not taken an office spent uh, office space on rent as of now. So most of the time it's here. ये सब जो furniture है, ये क्या landlord ने provide किया? ये आपने खरीदा? Rent pay kya hai? Yeah, furniture is on rent only. I think I follow a very millennial kind of a mindset here where uh, I love to take this on rent only. It uh, saves a lot of my cost and I didn't want the hassle to buy it and again fix it up by myself itself. So I thought let's take it on rent and I was not sure how many months I have to So rather than, of, rather than buying the furniture and then taking to some other place when I shift, hoga, I thought ki, let's take it on rent and the next one will come, he can use the furniture. Can I see the kitchen? Yeah, sure. Is, is that a part that you use quite often, kitchen? Not me. I barely go into my kitchen. Uh, Vishal, like this is the kitchen and I'll introduce you to like the most important person of our house. He's Raju okay. and he, he's a full-time cook here. He stays with us okay. and he makes food for us. We make food for him. 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 So Kushal, we saw your bedroom, your living room. What do you do? We met the most important person in your house. Yeah. Uh, let's see the most important feature that got you over here. The amenities you spoke about. Uh, let's see those amenities and yeah. continue the chat there. Sure, sure. I would love to show you all the amenities oh. there. So I think when I moved in here, no, I mean I was just very happy because of the positive vibe which this place gives me. And you'll see the view now. I mean, I, this, this is the place where I was extremely shocked when I saw the view. So the first day I came in here and I was at this this juncture itself and when I turned here I was like oh my god this is altogether a different view or maybe a different city altogether I don't know if I'm in Mumbai or if I'm in Singapore or Dubai so you know like I just stood here and I was standing here for 5-10 seconds I was just seeing like what is happening right now so, so the entire so landscape of, uh, of super tall buildings yeah 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 entire landscape of super tall buildings plus I think a lot of greenery is there and a lot of uh, you know positive vibe so Kushal, uh, we are in the amenity section yeah. of your project. Yeah. It uh, definitely looks spectacular. Right. Uh, the backdrop, the amenities here. Yeah. Uh, what are the amenities that you use uh, 
मोस्ट कॉमनली आई ऑलमोस्ट यूज एवरी थिंग टू बी ऑनस्ट ऐसा लगता है कभी कभी एमेनिटीज मेरे लिए बनाए गए सो आई यूज द स्विमिंग पूल क्वाइट ऑफन लेट से वंस इन अ मंथ वंस इन अ फोर्थ नाइट आई यूज द कैफे वेरी रेगुलरली ऑलमोस्ट एवरी डे इन द इवनिंग आई गो टू द कैफे टू हैव अ कोल्ड कॉफी दैट्स माई फेवरेट आई शुड गेट अ रेफरल एक्चुअली मैं जो भी दोस्तों को बुलाता हूँ मैं उनको भी कोल्ड कॉफी पिलाता हूँ एंड उनका कोल्ड कॉफी का सेल्स तो मेरी वैसे ही होता है ऐसे मुझे कभी कभी लगता है जस्ट किडिंग दैट्स वन एंड अपार्ट फ्रॉम दैट आई थिंक आई यूज लाइब्रेरी ऑन अ रेगुलर बेसिस दैट्स लाइक वेर आई गो फॉर रीडिंग और यू नो वैन आई वॉन्ट सम पीस ऑफ माइंड दैट्स अ वेरी वेरी साइलेंट एरिया आई मीन वहाँ पर जाके एकदम इतना शांति मिलता है ना इट्स लाइक कि आई जस्ट आई कैन स्लीप हेयर इट्स लाइक दैट दैट पीसफुल एंड अपार्ट फ्राम दैट आई प्ले टेबल टेनिस रेगुलरली आई प्ले फ्राम नाइन थर्टी टू टेन पी एम मेरा फिक्स रूटीन है विद लाइक फ्यू ऑफ माई फ्रेंड्स सो दैट्स ऑन द एमिटीज दी अदर पार्ट दैट रियली वन नोटिस ओवर हेयर आर द नंबर ऑफ पीपल सोशल सेटअप राइट सो देर आर टू थाउजेंड फ्लैट्स इन दिस एंटायर बिल्डिंग एंड अपार्ट फ्राम दैट यू नो लाइक इन दीज टू थाउजेंड फ्लैट्स इट सेल्फ लाइक देर आर अराउंड एट थाउजेंड पीपल हुआ स्टेंग इन दिस सोसाइटी and uh, it's like if you're staying in this society you get to network with a lot of people as well so that's like one of the things and uh, of course like whenever i need any help i can just put up whatsapp message in a whatsapp group and everyone would be more than willing to help so one of the factors was this ability to network in yeah, such a like a community yahan pe it's like you can literally talk to anyone you can meet like a lot of people who are mds and ceos of listed companies you can get to learn from them and most of them are willing to help aisa nahi hai ki wo bolenge ki are mera time jayega most of them are like okay what do you want to do like if they see if they see a young entrepreneur they are like ki how can i help this guy to grow more in their life rather than having that mindset ki mereko kya milega isse so that's the thing which i love about this society pehle mujhe aisa lagta tha ki mumbai mein neighbors bhi ek dusre ko nahi jante but i know almost all of them like there are three neighbors four flats on one floor and i know every one of them so kushal i see uh, a sitting area over here yeah uh, lots of well, lots of plants yeah uh, what would be the one big change for people of your age when they come and see a setup uh, uh, over here does that make you behave differently does it give you a different perspective that's a brilliant question i think one of the best questions to be honest so my mindset has changed completely from the time i have moved here before this i was more like an you know like i was more of, more of a person who loves spoon feeding or who love ki जो कोई आके मुझे कुछ बोले और मैं तभी काम करूंगा बट इधर आने के बाद ऐसा लगता है कि आई एम मीटिंग सो मेनी न्यू पीपल एंड लर्निंग फ्रॉम देम कि हाउ टू हैव दर ऑन्ट्रप्रनरियल माइंड सेट यू नो हाउ टू ऑलवेज गिव योर बेस्ट नो मैटर वॉट यू डू एंड हाउ टू ऑलवेज स्टे हम्बल एंड ग्राउंडेड नो मैटर हाउ सक्सेसफुल यू आर इन योर लाइफ दीज आर सम थ्री थिंग विच आई लर्न इन द लास्ट सिक्स मंथ ऑफ माई लाइफ एट लोढ़ा पार्क तो बेसिकली वेन यू मूव डोर यू आर इन जॉब या 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 सो आई वॉज वर्किंग एट आदित्य बिरला ग्रुप एंड आई क्विट माई जॉब ऑन थर्टी एथ जून टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी टू so basically fair for me to then uh, infer that uh, loda park and its community uh, made a employee resign and become an employer <laughs> probably you can say that uh, that might be true so you mentioned that this project uh, converted a employee from an employer by being in this environment how much is uh, this entire expedition or this uh, staying over here costing you so the rent as per the agreement is 1.3 lakh per month and the furniture rent is 8500 per month so total of 1 lakh 38500 we've got a good deal because of uh, covid so it's it was taken 2 years back by my previous flatmates and i replaced one of my friends so uh, the market rates are uh, high as of now so around like i think 1.7 lakhs per month are the market rates going over here so basically this amount that is there that is shared between three of you all right so on an average 45000 per month is my rental expense and uh, since you are an entrepreneur yeah. uh, you're funding it through your earnings of uh, social media yeah. Well. yeah 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 so basically i'll tell you so social media happens side it's like it's my side gig i devote 5 to 10% of my week's time in social media content creation and that gets me like a good amount of money i try to ensure that my rental expense is not more than 10 to 15% of my total income so for young people like you uh, is renting the future or is purchasing an apartment the future for a person like me who firstly doesn't have the capital to purchase a house and secondly knows that renting can happen at 3% per annum that's it i would definitely go for renting and after a point of time if i make sufficient amount of money and if i build some amount of wealth creation in my life then even like i come from a family where let's say we have this mindset ki okay khud ka ghar hona chahiye so i come from a marwadi family and ye hota hi hai ki khud ka ghar to hona hi chahiye definitely so after a point of time then i wouldn't mind purchasing the apartment because uh, that's the upbringing which i have been uh, coming from and ultimately i would want my parents also to shift here with me after let's say 2 3 years once i've built my own startup and company so basically renting uh, for the short and medium term yeah. long term you want to buy something yeah that's for me okay on that note uh, nice to speak with you uh, kushal uh, your 
you are you're a young person a uh, lot of activities you're doing uh, look forward to tracking the many developments that take place both on social media and uh, off social media uh, all the best and uh, yeah next time when i come maybe after 5 years you still are uh, renting but after 10 years you probably are staying in one of the apartments <laughs> on which you own hopefully let's see hope for the best but thank you so much for having me it was wonderful interacting with you as well time for the report card uh, first up uh, this is a three bedroom apartment of almost 1100 square feet not too big not too small uh, so it's a 50 50 in that regard uh, second is in terms of the surrounding uh, this is a top class uh, neighborhood and surrounding uh, lots of amenities uh, the ecosystem is thriving over here third in terms of uh, connectivity and transport uh, uh, the rail st railway station is not very close by uh, traffic over here is legendary for its snail like pace so all in all uh, if you're a family Uh, that wants a flourishing list of amenities wants a high end neighborhood is okay battling the inconveniences of traffic and transport uh, has necessarily uh, private transport at their disposal this is very well the sort of neighborhood and project that can be considered